Well, like most things in science, and this again is a thing that is not always easy to grasp, when these questions were first raised, they were first raised over a hundred years ago, we didn't really know enough to answer them. Even when it first became really a serious possibility that we were changing the climate 30 years ago or so, there were room for lots of questioning. But remember, computer power has doubled every 18 months for the last several years, Moore's Law. A lot of effort has gone into this. We have an increasingly good understanding. And in particular, if you run things backward, I mean, you know, prediction is hard, but, uh, particularly about the future, but if you run things backwards, putting in all the effects that have changed climate in the past, and run the computer models, and compare it with what's actually happened over the last few decades, they're very different. When you put in the additional CO2 that we've been putting in by burning fossil fuels, you get an almost perfect fit. That's what lends increasing confidence. That's why you get the statement from the G8 academies. 